Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Scalpel, a.k.a. The Doctor. Oh, and, yeah. There we have the Transformers Revenge of the Fallen game. Revenge of the Fallen studio copy. Got the Autobot Samoa and Peter Korn, Grim, G1 Grimlocks, Cosmos, Mark Ryan, Michael Bay's Silo, Silo of Buffs is back here. It's right up there. And got the game again. Uh, and then the other studio copy. And here we have Scalpel. Okay. This is how I'm probably going to have my set review like this. I might add some more Revenge of the Fallen stuff to it in the background. You guys could see that in the background if you guys want to while I'm doing my review or something. I don't know, whatever. So here we have Scalpel. Scalpel is a microscope. He's a white, black, gray, purple microscope. Um, nothing usual. He just goes up and down. Just go like that. Blah, blah, blah. Um, he has a Decepticon symbol right there. You could see um, through these in a way like the light you can't really like literally see through it like oh i can see the autobots and we're like if i put something like right here i can see this or like you know like what it is meant for i'll show you when it's time to review it. okay so um no articulation for this but i read it nine that's pretty cool it's a scout class um got this the legs under here um yeah, okay, so, you wanna just, for transformation, you wanna lift this up. Uh, lift these up. Push these up. And then, we want to flip out the legs, turn them around. Flip them out. There's three on each side, so there's six total. I keep on flipping them out. And you can see they're like spider crabby thingies, like legs that have purple on them. And then what we want to do is turn this around 180, bring it down, push these together up. Now bring this this all the way up like that. There. And then. We'll want to take out the head, take, bring them these out, take out the arms. You can't see them little clear plastic things. Ah, right. I hate it when these things pop off. Bring these down. The black sides go on the inside. Put those together. I think this, yeah, this is how it goes, doesn't it? Yeah. And then we want to bring up the antennas, fix the arms, and then there we go. He has a little like he looks like a um, praying mantis in a way. I don't know. And you have his like, little face. You can bring the mouth. You see the mouth? You bring that up. Have it like this. So now you can see. Uh, you can see like a little through in here, not really, but um, the other side is right here. See, like, look. I put this in a light. And then light will come through it, see? It has red eyes, see, it has as many colors now, or purple. Black, same colors. Yeah. Uh, I rate this at 9, like, 9.5, 10. That's pretty cool, right? Um, he's pretty small. Um, let's see what this guy. He's a little bit smaller than classic Bumblebee, uh, if you count the backpack, but if you count the head, he's bigger. But then, you know, because he could rise and then go down, now he's small, now he's big, yeah. So that's the Revenge of the Fallen Scalpel. Thank you for watching. This is a review of Transformers Revenge of Fallen Scalpel, aka the Dark.